Okay, let's get back to it. <laughs> okay, so dun 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 dun. What's up, everybody? It's me, Super Biggie, and today we are playing some more Skyrim. So, uh, first things first, I actually want to get into the mods and uh, activate the Star Wars. Play with mods at your own risk. You may experience issues with mods. You can disable mods via load order and go back to your original save. Ah, here we go. Here we go. Starfire Wars. Here we go. Let's download, shall we? Happy Star Wars Day. I put this together last night on a whim. Also, two followers under the... Wait, there are also two followers under the bridge to the cause of Winterhold. They fought a fateful duel on the bridge. They saw... All that saw both of them fall to the ground far below. Come on, and ignore enemy... Oh, hold on. They can be purchased from a merchant found just outside of High Hrothgar, near the last shrine on the path up the mountain. Starfire weapons swing very quickly and ignore enemy armor. There's also an invader near Ravenscar Hollow, a dark invader. Ooh. Ooh, that's a Sith. Oh, that's a dual wielding. Oh, that's a purple blade. Oh. <laughs> yes. Whoa. Oh, my library. Okay. The game will now reload your data files. Ah. Okay. I see. Okay, I see. So, uh. This would be cool. Okay, so, uh, continue from your last save. Yes. Ah, come on! Right now? Really? Right here? Okay, never mind. We're gonna actually go back to the mods and not... We're gonna disable it. We wanna earn those trophies. You know? So, uh, hang on here. Let's go ahead and disable that mod. I want to use the mod, but you know what? We can't. So let's disable. Here we go. Okay. Uh-oh. That's where it was. Okay, yep, there we go. Reload. Thank you. And now we can, uh, do the actual game, shall we? My very first thing is I need to get to level 12. At least, because, uh, well, um, well, uh, I had it before on my PS3, I didn't have a place, and I, uh, like when I came back, I used the, this old hagger's house or something, and uh, I lost all my weapons and armor that I had saved as like a collection. Oh boy. So, yeah. I'm a little, uh. kinda happy. Okay, so. Looks like he's gone for good this time. But I don't think we should stick around to see if he comes back. The closest town from here is Riverwood. My uncle's a blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Well, I'm gonna follow you, actually. Travel to Soulstein. Is this where you're going? Ah. Listen, you should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. If the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I'm coming. 
Join the Imperial Legion, you know. And See that ruin up there, Bleak Falls Barrow. When I was a boy, that place always used to give me nightmares. Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. I like how he knows I'm still following him. I admit, I still don't much like the look of it. These are the Guardian Stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's Mage, landscape. Warrior. Go ahead. See for yourself. Warrior. Good. I knew you shouldn't have been on that cult the minute I laid eyes on you. I like he just knows I'm following him. So he's basically giving me a tour. Let's see. So, hmm. Let's see, my pet breed noticed uh stale at the bannered mare. Okay, so let's see, unbound. Wait, is this completed? Yeah. Before the storm. Ah. Actually, let's also... Oh, out oh, there. There. My pet mud crab. Uh, this... I have no... Let's see, put a fork in it. Let's see, show map. Yep, I already know how it works. Yep. Okay. So Windhelm, obviously, would be to set the destination. But that's where I'm thinking, right? Let's see, where am I at? No. Listen, as far as I'm concerned, you've already earned your power. But until we get that confirmed by General Tullius, just stay clear of other Imperial soldiers and avoid any complications, alright? Yes, gotcha. <laughs> what was that? You decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. Uh huh. I'm glad too. I'm gonna keep this safe point. Here we go, Riverwood. Come on. Let's look at items real quickly. Weapons. Weight is zero, so that's why I like about that. Oh, uh, I should probably drop one of these. Oh, wait, hang on. I'll drop that. Wait, I can keep that actually for smelting. Never mind. Ah. Yes, here we go. Bad A horn.
Ah, look at that arrow just in the middle. Let's see, miscellaneous. The bear. <clears throat> Ah, here we go. Necromancer and attack units and so on. Blah, 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 blah. Let's see, you change creatures. I change those two. Okay. Oh. Ah, here we go. You seem to be quite trustworthy. Would you be interested in purchasing him? If so, please meet with me in my laboratory in Understone Keep. Read these actually later on. Actually, you know what? I'll let you read them for a second. I'm not gonna read it, but I'm gonna turn the pages, kind of, and then you just pause the video if you want to read. There we go. <coughs> There we go. Okay, that's the end of that one. And then, uh, the Dragonborn book. And for the record, I'm also gonna pause too on my own video, so I can read these. Okay. Keys. I don't know why I still have this. Helgen Keep. I hope that dragon is still flying around there somewhere. Woo! Chicken! 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 Things look quiet enough here. Come on. There's my uncle. Uncle Halvor. Hello. What are you doing here? Are you on leave from shores, boats? What happened to you, boy? Shh, are you in some Uncle, kind please. of trouble? Keep your voice down. I'm fine, but we should go inside to talk. What's going okay. on? And who's this? He's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything, but we need to go inside. Okay, okay, come inside then. Sigrid will get you something to eat. And you can tell me all about it. A dragon! I saw a dragon! What? What is it now, Mother? It was as big as the mountain and black as night. It flew right over the barrel. Dragons now, is it? Please. New to Riverwood? If you keep on, if like you're looking for work, go see Hot at the main. There you go. Sigrid, we have company. So would it be stealing? Yes, it would. Oh my god, okay. Hadvar, we've been so worried about you. Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you something to eat. Now then, boy, what's the big mystery? What are you doing here looking like you lost an argument with a cave bear? I don't know where to stop. You know I was assigned to General Tully as a skull. We were stopped in Helgen when we were attacked by a dragon. A dragon? That's ridiculous. You aren't drunk, are you, boy? Husband, let him tell his story. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. Gosh dang! I don't know if anyone else got out alive. I doubt I'd made it out myself if not for my friend here. I need to get back to solitude then. Let's look at magic real quickly. Let's see, destruction. <coughs> hmm. Eight points per save. 
let's equip that real quickly, and then let's... Actually, no. What are we doing? There you go. Let's see here. Active effects. Ah, okay. Yeah, there you go. I know what's... I thought you could help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. But I need your help. We need your help. Oh. Oh. Okay, let's see. See, let's take a walk. Baby. Oh, can I take it off? Oh. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Cross the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. When you get to White Run, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Jarl Balgraf? He rules White Run Hold. A good man, perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last, though. I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Elisif much. Who can blame him? But I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. He's no traitor. Of course, Skyrim has always been part of the Empire. That doesn't mean I support everything the Empire's been doing lately. But Nords have never been fair-weather friends. Ah, I forget you're new to Skyrim. Jarl Elisif, I should say. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torig when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torig, you know. Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Shouted him to death. If you believe the stories. That's what started this whole war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. Once the Jarls start killing each other, we're back to the bad old days. Okay. Gerder's family first settled here as woodcutters a few generations ago. She and Hod run the mill. I make a decent living sharpening axes and fixing the sawmill. So what we're gonna try to do here... <coughs> people are rightly <coughs> stirred up about the damn Thalmor being allowed to roam around arresting people, just for worshipping Talos. But was it worth tearing Skyrim apart and maybe destroying the Empire? No. Ulfric will have a lot to answer for in the end. Nords have always supported the Empire, and the Empire has always been good for Skyrim. It's from that treaty that ended the Great War, remember? When the Emperor was forced by the Talmor to outlaw Talos' worship. We didn't pay much attention to it when I was a boy. Everyone still had their little shrine to Talos. But then, Ulfric and his sons of Skyrim started agitating about it. And sure enough, the Emperor had to crack down. Dragging people off in the middle of the night. One of the main causes of this war, if you ask me. I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. 
Like I said, I'm glad to help. Take what you need, my friend. Within reason, of course. All right, then. Did you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? Hush, child. Don't pester your cousin. Oh, cousin. Can I help you? Okay, so let's see. Did you really ah. see a dragon? Anything that says steel? Is Alvor, the blacksmith. I'm his assistant. I mean, apprentice. I mean, apprentice. Yeah, sure you are. Oh, that hurt. I don't want to steal. What you need, my friend. Within reason, of course. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Too friendly to strangers, but you seem all Make right. Make yourself at home. I just hope the war doesn't come to Riverwood. There's enough trouble in the world without those storm cloaks stirring up more. Huh. All right then. Let's see. Oh, hunting bow. I'm spoken for, you know, so don't get any ideas. Alvar and I, we got a daughter, little Dorothy.
Oh. My father is Alvor, the blacksmith. I'm his assistant. I mean apprentice. Um, are you in trouble? Is that why you're hiding like that? Okay, it's when it's in, uh, when it's red. Okay, I forgot which barrels I can look through. Oh, hi. Make yourself at home. Girl likes to work the forge with her papa. Thank you. I'm spoken for, you know, so don't get any ideas. Ooh, let me chop some wood. There's a way for me to chop wood. How do I chop the wood? Did you really see a dragon? Yes, I did. Damn Stormcloak rebels. So did I. If the damn Stormcloak somehow found one, or woke it up, the war might be about to take an ugly turn. Hard to believe it was just a coincidence that the first dragon anyone seen for centuries attacks just as Ulfric was about to be executed. Or you didn't know? That was Ulfric Stormcloak and his top lieutenants. Right, the leader of the Stormcloaks. They claim to be fighting for Skyrim's freedom, but the war is really all about Ulfric wanting to be High King of Skyrim. You haven't heard of the civil war in Skyrim? I guess down in Cyrodiil, people have other things to worry about. It's pretty simple. Ulfric founded the Stormcloaks years ago, as a sort of private army to advance his ambitions. He's always used the ban on the worship of Talos to stir people up against the Empire. He never succeeded in getting much support, so a few months ago he murdered the High King. That got the Empire's attention. A masterstroke by General Tullius. He's only been in charge here for a few months, but he's turned things around for the Empire. We've been trying to catch Ulfric since the war started, but he always seemed to slip through our fingers, like he knew we were coming. This time, the general turned the tables on him. Ulfric rode right into our ambush with only a few bodyguards. He surrendered pretty meekly too. So much for his death or glory reputation. I thought we were taking Ulfric back to Cyrodiil, but I guess the general changed his mind. You know the rest. Of course. I know today wasn't the best introduction to the Legion, but I hope you'll give us another chance. The Legion could really use someone like you, especially now. Oh yeah. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. No, not yet. After all, a dragon, something out of old tales and legends, no one could have expected that. Mm -hmm. But you can bet he'll be trying to figure it out. <laughs> This could shift the whole balance of the war. If you want to help stop that dragon, your best bet is to go to Solitude and join up with the Legion. I hope so. The Legion is Skyrim's only hope right now. Come on, we better get moving. What the Rebels like to forget is that the Empire is what's keeping the Dominion out of Skyrim. 
I guess that wasn't such a big deal elsewhere in the Empire. But here, it's caused a lot of resentment. Native son and all that. Even I'll admit it hasn't been the Empire's finest hour. But it wasn't like the Emperor had any choice, did he? If he hadn't signed the peace treaty with the Thalmor, they would have destroyed the Empire. And where would Skyrim be? That's the part that Ulfric's supporters oh, hey, always okay. conveniently forget about. Where did he come Unless from? Unless the Empire stands together, the Thalmor will destroy us all. General Tullius has his headquarters in Castle Dower, in the city of Solitude, northwest of here. You'll want to talk to Legate Ricca. She deals with the new recruits. I'll be sure to put in a good word for you if I get back to Solitude first. Oh, come on! Be careful on the way to Solitude. Damn storm mm -hmm. Okay, so first things first. Just so that way we have it. Your guard up. I do. General okay. Tullius has his headquarters in Castle Dower, okay, in the city of Solitude, yep. northwest of here. Yep, I got it. I like how I'm using it even though I don't have it. Oh, what's it called? It's uh Mars. it starts with an M. Look at that, see? Oh, why am I holding that the wrong way? Okay, uh, I'm just gonna ignore this.
steel dagger. I don't think I need this. One of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. I don't know what you over... Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. You could? got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Show those thieves not to s Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Northeast of town. Logan? Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think you. Bleak Falls Barrow is just outside of town. I can show you. Fine. But only to Bleak Falls Barrow is just outside of town. I can show you. Well, how can you show me? This way. Whoops. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. I should probably save. I think that's a good idea. This way. I wonder why they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. Oh, there you go. <coughs> This is the bridge out of town. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll throw a fit if I take too long. <laughs> Such a child. Okay, so.
Let's see here. Mara bless you for agreeing to help us. Sleeping giant in. I might have to broadcast this. Orgnar. Orgnar, are you Feindal thinks he can woo Camilla Valeria so Sure. What can I do for you? We need to get a new batch. You look like a traveler. Truly? Yep. So maybe my mother isn't crazy after? You had best tell the Jarl in Whiterun. He needs to know about this. Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak with her when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. You may be right. Camilla may see Feindel as little more than a friend. Here, give Camilla this letter. It's full of venomous nonsense. Tell her it's from Feindel. Uh-oh. At the Bard's College in Solitude, they train bards and scalds like myself. If you go there, talk to Viarmo. He's the headmaster. Lucan's got a little bit of everything. If you need weapons or armor, see Alvor, the blacksmith. Until next time. What do you want? Got any ale or mead? Got any ale or mead? Until next time. My favorite drinking buddy. Let's get some mead. Until next time. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. Long as you clean up, you know how to use it, right? Mix a couple of ingredients together. A little wheat and blister wart makes a healing potion, if you didn't know. We have plenty of ingredients for sale, too. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty. There have been whispers. A boy up in Windhelm, Sorry, name of Aventus Aretino, been trying to con- Have you seen that shrine of Azura? They say the dark e nobody kinda... trusts those mages yes. way up north in their college. Gods only know what the word is. Ulfric Stormcloak escaped from the Imperials. War's only gonna get worse. Word is Ulfric Stormcloak escaped. We've got something of a love triangle here in Riverwood. Feindel and Sven, this both vying for Camilla's Sven. affections. We've got something of a love. Word is Ulfric Storm. Word is Ulfric Stormcloak is looking to blow. Be a lot safer just to have the Jarl's wizard teach you a thing or two. All right then. Drive out the Stormcloaks and restore what we own. With our blood and our steel, we will take back our home. Down with Ulfric, the killer of kings. On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll see. We're the children of Skyrim and we fight all our lives. And when Sovereign Guard beckons, every one of us dies. But this okay, I'm gonna save. Just before I steal the coin. <clears throat> Land there you go. is ours, and we'll see it wiped clean of the scourge that has you know no. I'm gonna our earn hopes my and our dreams. 
Let's get rid of all these tutorials. There we go. You're that visitor been poking around. They say a dragon attacked Helgen. Word is Ulfric Storm. They say a dragon blah, blah, blah. attacked Helgen. They say a dragon attacked okay, Helgen. Okay, here it is. Sounds like hogwash to me. Here we go. Wait, that's the wrong door. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna go through all buildings real quickly. <laughs> there we go. Mara Black. You're a strapping young man. Don't be a stranger. Ooh, um, um, um. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Which one is, uh. We're gonna go be good. We're not gonna lie. What are you talking about? What? Oh, my. He. He want. Thank you for telling me the truth. Could you talk to Feindal as well? I'm sure he'll want to thank you for standing up for him. Good luck. Lucan and I will be waiting for you back in the shop. Okay, come on, Lucan. Here we go. Okay. Any other buildings I can go to? I don't like this one. Oh, okay. It's, just, it's literally just a tiny thing. You're kind of fuzzy. What's wrong with you? We got rooms and food, drink, do. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. What do you want? That letter ought to convince Camilla to never speak to Feindal ever again. Mm -hmm. All right then. All right then. Where is Feindal? Here we go. Oh, there we go. Let's see. <sighs> yep, okay. Ah, here we go. Ah, here we go. We got these guys. Ah, oh, freak. Nah, we'll, we'll quit. I didn't mean to get myself a bounty. Okay, crap. No, let's do this. Let's do this. We'll... Ah! Freak. Gosh dang it.
No. Break. No. Ah. On the oh, there we once was a hero food. named Ragnar the Red who came I riding to Whiterun from the old Derek Stick. Okay. Okay, so, first things first. We gotta go back here because of where I saved. So, let's give her the letter. You're strapping. What are you talking? Oh my. Yep. Thank you for telling me the truth. Could you talk to Feindal as well? Okay, You're not from around here. That makes two. Ah, he's right. There's a way for me to knock. Tree that thick. Oh. Nah. I don't need one. I don't need one. That there was human strength there. that tutorial out of the way. Oh boy. <laughs> Thank you. 
Riverwood's agreeable enough, I suppose. For a north. I'll show you what I know. I appreciate your help. Please, take this. Some gold I've saved up from working at the mill. Lead the way. Okay, so... Okay, well actually, let's see. Uh, I don't know if you'll see this, but... 